Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today we will study about solar eclipse. A solar eclipse occurs when the moon is positioned between the earth and the sun and casts a shadow over the earth. Solar eclipses only occur during a new moon phase, usually about twice a year, when the moon aligns itself in such a way that it eclipses the sun. Eclipse means any dimming or obstruction of light. Even though the sun is about 400 times bigger than the moon, it is also about 400 times farther away. This makes the sun and moon appear almost exactly the same size in the sky. The moon's orbit is tilted about 5 degrees compared to the plane of Earth's orbit around the sun. Because of this tilt, the moon, as seen from Earth's perspective, usually passes above or below the sun when it passes between the Earth and the sun. The umbra is a region of total shadow, while penumbra is a region of partial shadow. The word umbra means shadow. The word penumbra means almost shadow. Observers on Earth who are within the smaller central umbra See the sun completely blocked. The path of the moon's shadow across the Earth's surface is called the path of totality. We are expecting a total solar eclipse on 8th April 2024. The width of the path within which people will experience a total eclipse of the sun will be about 183 kilometers on average. The timing, including how long the totality lasts, depend on location, but some spots will see moon fully cover the sun for up to 4 minutes and 28 seconds. In order to see the sun totally eclipsed by the moon, you must be in the path of totality. Viewers outside this path usually see partial eclipse or even no eclipse. People are very excited about 8th April 2024 eclipse. They are also traveling to the areas of totality to experience total eclipse of 4 minutes and 28 seconds. There are several myths about solar eclipse in history. The Chinese once believed that an eclipse was caused by an invisible dragon eating the sun. For many ancient cultures, a solar eclipse was a sign of doom and destruction. In Tahitian myth, the sun and moon are in love with each other and meet each other at the time of solar eclipse. There are four types of solar eclipse. One, total solar eclipse. Two, partial solar eclipse. Three, annular solar eclipse. Four, hybrid solar eclipse. A total solar eclipse happens when the moon passes between the sun and earth, completely blocking the face of the sun. A partial solar eclipse happens when the moon passes between the sun and the earth, but the sun, moon and earth are not perfectly lined up. Only part of the sun is covered, giving it crescent shape. Annular eclipse occurs because moon's orbit around the earth is not perfectly circular and neither is earth's orbit around the sun. Both orbits are slightly elliptical or oval shaped, meaning moon changes distance from the earth as it orbits the earth and the earth changes distance from the sun throughout the year. An annular solar eclipse happens when the moon passes between the sun and the earth but the moon is at the furthest point from the earth. Because the moon is further away from earth, it appears smaller than the sun and does not completely cover the sun. The moon appears as a dark disk on top of a large bright disk, creating what looks like a ring around the moon. Annular means ring shape. Hybrid solar eclipses are rare. 
The last one was in 2013. The next one will be in 2031. Because that surface is curved, sometimes an eclipse can shift between annular and total as moon's shadow move across the Earth. The solar eclipse begins with first contact. It is when moon begins to pass over solar disk. It begins from right in the northern hemisphere. As the eclipse edges towards second contact, the moment of totality begins. The sunlight is completely blocked by the moon. The diamond ring first appears 10 or more seconds before totality. A dazzling burst of light. It has a beautiful resemblance to a diamond ring. As the moon moves to completely cover the sun, all that's left are small receding points of light that exist because of irregular shape of moon. These are known as belly beads. The third contact occurs when total or annular phase of solar eclipse ends. For total solar eclipse, we will observe second diamond ring effect The moon continues to move until it no longer overlaps the sun disk. The eclipse is over. This phase is known as fourth contact. Looking at the sun directly can lead to a temporary or even permanent vision loss. Eclipse glasses are dark enough to keep dangerous amount of light from entering the eyes. The strongest glasses absorb 99% of light. May Allah bless us all. Thank you for watching. Allah face.